allowed to make fun of. Like pieces of shits. Like you're allowed to make fun of pieces of shits anytime. Like uh, that's a free. That's free reign. Or like fuck boys. Like when you make fun of fuck boys, yeah, that's free reign. You decide to be a fuck boy. That's not my problem. Yeah, hundred percent, hundred percent. That's 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 why I host Fuck Boy Fridays and hopes that a true fuck boy comes through and tells me about his life. Because honestly, fuck boy stories are some of the funniest shit. What is They're fuck boy Friday? What is fuck boy Fridays? Yo, Fuckboy Fridays is where we all get together on my stream and we confess our fuckboy sins for the week. Like, any petty shit you did, any stupid shit you did, you did something get back at your girl, your girl fucked up your day somehow, or your man fucked up your day. The funniest stories are always girls telling me about what fuckboys did to them. Because it's like, yo, this mother... Because a lot of the girls I know are kind of smart, so when a fuckboy tries some shit... Like they get, they're on it. So like these stories be hilarious. And some of these fuck boys are fuck girls themselves because they just, the, I got this one person in my chat. She, she's on Tinder more than I am. She's got like four or five fuck buddies right now. She's just over here like, yeah, that one gets me digmatized. That one is possessive. He's a piece of shit. This wait, one wait, buys wait, me wait, 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 I'm so, the first word, digmatized? Digmatized. Yeah, when you get fucked so good, like your, le your legs don't work and like you're in love for like a couple hours, it passes eventually. You I just never... didn't hear the phrase digmatize. Oh, okay. you never heard the phrase digmatize? Hypnotized, but by dick. Digmatized. Got it, got it, got it. So, uh, somebody who's digmatized. It's, it's actually a universal term. It, men can be digmatized by women. It's just the phrase is digmatized. Get used to it. Or by other men. So like, Yes, or by other men. <laughs> it's it's almost like simping, but it's like to an extreme level. Simping means you're doing shit, but you're not getting the coochie. Dickmatized means you're doing crazy shit to get the coochie. You know what I mean? Like that girl that lets the broke dude smash, but he always has her car because he's at work, but he's broke. Like she knows she, he has a baby mama. You know what I mean? She's dickmatized though. The dick's so good. She's doing dumb shit, you know? Dickmatized. It's real. Allow me to post this on the vlog and tag you. Just this section care. right here. <laughs> it's, 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 it's absolutely true. Or like guys, or like guys that bite a girl, like like this girl let him hit once or twice. So like he takes her to like downtown or he buys her those purses. You know, I'm not there's no free promos on this channel, but you know the person I'm talking about, you know what I mean? <laughs> but it's like it's like yo, like it's like, yo, are y'all dating? Nah. Where'd she get that bag from? Oh, I got it from her. Is it a birthday? Nah. It's like, oh, okay. People would say that's simping, but once you get the cheeks, you can't be a simp. Once you get the cheeks, you can't be a simp. So are you, wait, 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 wait. Yes, yes. You're a simp if you're chasing somebody and doing things out of your nature, but you're not getting nothing. The moment you get some, you're no longer simping. You're now digmatized. Come on, bro. Keep up. Hold on. I am going to take the time to do a simp <laughs> definition. Simp. Google. Yeah, Google yeah. is open. Simp, no, a man listen. who foolishly <laughs> and overvalues. Uh, wait, wait. Yes. A man who foolishly overvalues and defers to a woman putting her on her pedestal. I believe yeah. you could be a simp and still get some. No. No. Once you get some... You're not overvaluing it. You got the value. You got what you're looking for. So how's that overvaluing it? If you got it, you can't overvalue it. You like if I if I say I'm not putting none out until I get a thousand dollars, and I get a thousand dollars, it's at value, right? No, 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 don't no, don't no, disappear. No. Oh, you can't see me in the in. camera. I because I just yeah. leaned in. Hold on. Okay. Because my the stream started buffering, so I disabled the second camera, okay? But, okay? What you could be doing is over, overvaluing the coochie to begin with. So, yeah, you're getting coochie, but if what you're doing to get the coochie is too much, then I would still say you're a sip. There are expensive ways to get it, and there are reasonable ways to get it. Hmm. You know That's what? where I would go with. I'll concede on that. Yeah, I'll concede on that. That's fair. You could still, yeah, you could still be simping. Fair enough. Fair enough. Fair enough. Yeah. Yo, here's the thing. Cause I never even thought of this conversation before, right? But as uh -huh. I'm thinking, like this is, this is new. <laughs> I can process this information, change my mind next week, right? But okay. here I am. Like if if I gotta if I gotta freaking lick the floor. In order to get it from Jennifer Lopez, 
right? Uh huh. That's not the same value as licking the floor for some chick that works at whatever place. I'm not going to randomly target places because fair enough. You know fair what I'm enough. saying? Okay. So okay. So better. I guess my I guess my my first explanation for digmatize wasn't specific. It was too broad. You're right. Digmatize refers to you're specifically. Oh, I even use the word simping. You're specifically simping because you got the cheeks. Like you was acting normal without the cheeks, but now you got the cheeks and you're doing that extra shit. You see what I mean? Yeah, yeah. Like you could always be a simp, but digmatize specifically means after you got the cheeks, you started going above and beyond or you start doing some crazy shit. Digmatized. No, I'm with you. I just, better. It was everything no, you're right. saying. Everything you're, you're right. saying was on point. It's just when you said simping, I was like, "No, nah, I think you can still get cheeks and be a simp." Nah, you right. You right. You can still simp and you can still get cheeks and be a simp. Cause yo, I, I, I <laughs> as I start talking, I already know what your face expression is gonna be. But I, I know of guys. You know, they, you know, they're getting the cooch, and they're still tolerating things that they shouldn't be tolerating. You know. <laughs> I knew it. I didn't mean to target you. So I'm like, yeah, I know you're getting it, but you overvalued it. I wasn't digmatized. I wasn't digmatized. <laughs> All right, man. Let's start a regular. Uh, but that being said, that's, oh, so that's that doesn't count for me because to me, simping is a sport. I just want to be the best. Hey, I didn't target you. It's just I just knew as I was started speaking, you were gonna. Yeah, yeah. I wasn't trying to get it to you. 15 minutes talking about simping, but I like it. So I, that's good. Yeah. <laughs> that's future podcast stuff. Those kind of topics, for the most part, are hard to do on the, like, uh, um, forced, if that makes sense. Like, no, you can never do it. You can never do it. Uh, this is one podcast I watch peer-to-peer, and basically, like, I think they come in topics, but I'm pretty sure they don't. But they always end up talking about either real-life shit that, like, young creators go through, or they start talking about the business side of YouTube and content creation, money on booms. Like, And I love it because it's it's basically what we do, but, like, they're younger than us, but they already made where we want to be. You know what I mean? Yeah. And it's like, hearing, them, hearing them talk about it, it's like, yo, yeah, this is the shit I'm going through right yeah. now. And it's like, but, like, they're going through stuff, like, personally that like i already done been through like ah oh, yeah young niggas ah oh, yeah <laughs> Woo, y'all in for it y'all even know yet y'all in for it. you know what they do so, like, they likely have topics that they have planned in case and then they never sh- get to them well yeah. you'd rather have a go-to topic in case you don't have anything to talk about but True. as you're going based on your topics if someone it's says something and you get heated up yeah. you go with yeah. it you know, people yep. say, like, when Martin Luther King was given the I Have a Dream speech, you could see him looking uh-huh. down at his paper, like, like in, the, like, the first half of it. And uh-huh. as he started getting hype, as he was heating up, he stopped yeah, looking he at the paper, paper, man. He's like, I don't need this paper, man. And just started that's spitting. <laughs> Dude, that's real life. Every time I start a meeting that I'm leading, I'm always like, okay, here's my bullet points. And then literally, like, three minutes in, I'm like, yo, fuck this paper, bro. Hey, here's what we're doing today. <laughs> I don't. Uh, I don't do well with. I don't do well with scripts. Like if I had to nah, do like a script, script, I would be. I can. I can do a script. Script. But whenever I do it my way, it always feels so much better. It's yeah, like, I'm on the fly. Be better, but y'all, y'all gotta let me do it. Like, y'all gotta. Y'all gotta let me be me. Let me be my person. All right, fam. Pulling up a regular now. Okay, faking my work now. Bet. Make sure I stay on my shit. <laughs> 